come back. Welcome more. back to part five. The four set tiebreaker. Can Joker hold on? The fist force a fifth set, or can Nadal win this in the tiebreak? I took a lot of focus. Oh, what a rally. What a rally. Not the longest one of the match, though. Oh, my finger slipped. Son of a gun. Oh, no way. <laughs> you couldn't see my thing down there, could you? No. Yes! Wow. Three nothing. God, this is familiar. Oh, yes! Is yes! Yes! Yo, oh, he's staying! He stayed! Oh. Five nothing! No, 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 Just God. like the first set tiebreak. I have no energy left. Aw, oh, my no man's land. Yes, oh, sir! Easy. We got six match points. And if you remember, he fought off all six of those match points in set one. Seven six three six six one seven six. Oh. Great match, Mr. Evan. Great match. Nice handshake there. I'll give him my hardware. Joker just could not play the tie breaks efficiently. Oh. That was the undoing. Man, I'm brutal. Brutal. Is there anything you'd like to say before we uh? <coughs> End this prediction video at five parts. Well, I hope this is the final, and I hope it goes five sets just for entertainment value. I, I'd also like to add in that's my prediction that it does go five sets. They play tiebreak though in the fifth set in French, don't they? No. No? No. Only at the U.S. Open. They really play a tiebreak in the fifth set. Uh, I also want to throw in that I hope Andy Roddick makes it past, like, fourth round. Give me some hope, please. There's the final match statistics there. 121 winners to 122. I had 21 on force to 10. Nine for 25 on the breakers. 23 of 38. You can tell who came to net more, obviously. And I won quite a few more points total. So, this is Renegade A7. 875 signing off. We'll see you next time. We'll see you next time for the Wimbledon finals prediction. That one might have Andy Roddick in it, but most likely not. <laughs>